Tonight, a big problem with pot. The Denver Department of Environmental Health recalling a popular brand of marijuana edibles. Molly Hendrickson is live, and Molly, inspectors telling you the edibles were contaminated? And that's because part of the process in making those products took place in a washing machine, much like this, Noah. Now, in January, the health department began routine inspections of manufacturers, and that's uncovered some new challenges in the industry. We would never use something that had soap in it. A.J. Ashkar is beside himself. Extremely frustrated. After the Denver Department of Environmental and Public Health recalled and destroyed his pot-infused brownie mixes and pixie sticks. This is to the tunes of tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars in damages. The problem, his company at Home Baked was using this washing machine to make water hash. YouTube video shows how plant matter is agitated with cold water to separate the THC glands, a common practice health inspectors say is unsanitary. We're just really not sure how um, a piece of equipment that's not designed and built and rated for food production is going to impact um, food that it may come in contact with. Inspectors point to these pictures showing a dirty, corroded machine. One tube, they say, was filled with mold. It was soiled and it was not in great repair. It was extremely clean a month ago when we had to stop using it. But Ashkar says those pictures are old. It's been sitting with stagnant water in it and unused. And a food safe version doesn't exist. He doesn't understand why the hash he makes is classified as a food and a drug as well. You know, technically nothing can be an ingredient and a drug at the same time. And the health department says those pictures were taken at the time of the inspection. We do want to note that no illnesses or other problems have been reported. The health department has given at home baked temporary permission to use a different machine, a newer machine, but it is still not approved for food. Reporting live in Denver, Molly Hendrickson, 7 News.